chance, but not guaranteed. So that was the kind of general kind of dog. What other notes have you guys well, got? Well, we had the budget, and I said the budget of the dog, and then I put toys, treats. These are also my notes, too. Yes. These are things you got to keep in mind for you as well. That's obvious. Toys, treats, food, and possibly, if any, vet bills. Oh, yeah, okay. And good. there's there's that big topic. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now, if you buy it, will it have it shots? Or Usually, some, some do and some don't. Yeah. Yeah, like when we were looking on Kijiji, they say that they've been dewormed um, for six. There's two or three. Well, yeah. Kobe said it needs a little booster of certain ones, mm -hmm. but yeah. And it will need to be spayed or neutered, because then he's looking at a female. Okay. So it, it will definitely need that. big thing is the training mm -hmm. and two things in my mind that are huge the training and that it needs to be imprinted on Ksenia so I think the timing is good because Nicole obviously knows how to train dogs because we've seen her dog and he's very well behaved so I think realistically with the amount of time that you and I are coming and going we're not particularly good dog trainers and we don't know how we have to figure it out and the other the other thing is that um i think it's really uh, i my i think it's really important that the dog imprints on ksenia and sits beside ksenia and so it would be easier to work with a trainer that doesn't live in the house i'm not here 20 or it'll imprint on me yeah, yeah, right? exactly. That's exactly. What, honestly, I think about that too. I yeah. Find any friend, so. Yes. But again, you're not here all the time. All the time. You're here, you're yeah. training, you go away, the dog's left with Ksenia. On that note that we're talking, we did what we were talking about over here.
conversation you guys had on the phone when you were on your way here. You had like a thousand questions in 0 0.3 seconds. <laughs> and I tried to take mental notes and I really tried. Budget food, poop, training. And training's a big thing and we could sit here for hours. Um, but yeah. Um, but yeah. so if you guys had a month, could it could it get pretty close to some basic training? That's what I had. It should be. It should know basic training when you guys are back yeah. in a couple months. Like it knows where to yeah. poop and where to pee and where its food the is. Poop and pee. It's hard to say. Yeah, different dogs are so different. <laughs> I can't say that. It it's, might be a Devon dog. Uh, yeah, I can't. I can't say. Toby yeah. was decent. Yeah. But um, everything, my advice would be, it has to be in a stable place. Yeah. If it's, it's... Yeah, and this is a good place. If it has Correct. accidents here, this is no problem. Wipe it up and off we go. We do have a game oh. plan on that. And I did talk to Cousin Belle because she's like the head of the, t of the caregiver team. And I said, we're thinking, Cindy's is thinking of getting a dog, but it's going to be a puppy and you're going to have to be trained so because the caregivers are going to have to do, be consistent with this too. And I said, you might, there might be a little poop and a little pee. And they said, we're already wiped up poop and pee. We're not worried about it. A little it. bit extra doesn't matter. That's what I have here too with everything. So whole team has to be on board yeah. with the training. Whole team has to be on board yeah. with the poop. Whole team has to be on board for, yeah. Yeah. And I'm sure Dad had questions about where the dog is going to poop. That's what yep. he said. This space right here might be a good puppy poop right. spot where it doesn't really impact anyone too much. You can put rocks yeah. there and it's an easy yeah. cleanup. Yeah. yeah. But so as long as it can be trained to poop on a puppy pad. But that's like a future thing that runs. Yes. But for when it's a puppy, yes. Pads yep. and then you're right, slowly. Yeah, um, migrated. Yeah. Out. Have you there's um there's this thing called um what is it called? The David Morley thing. This is radio thing, and the, uh, about this guy Damon Morley and Dave toilet trains cat. Oh, yeah, <laughs> but that's how he does it. He takes the litter box and he moves it slowly down the hallway, and then he puts it on top of the toilet. And he, I've done that with really? one of my cats. <laughs> it didn't turn out very well. Uh, <laughs> cat litter just everywhere in your yeah. bathroom. Yeah. No. Okay. <laughs> anyway, back to the dog. That was the the plan. What what um what other Questions that you raise? Um, no, no, just you got a budget for food and for the, everything else, yes? We have talked about that. Okay. I said it's probably gonna, well, okay, just from my example, I pay about, mm, his big old bag is like 60 something, 70 bucks. Yeah, I know. And that lasts about a month, month and a bit. Yeah. Probably a pro. Probably about the same. Yeah. yeah. Probably less, actually. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What else do you want? But if the rule is, if you really, the rule of thumb, the rule of thumb is with dogs, if you keep it exercised, mm -hmm. hopefully, ideally, you know, the hyperness, no, okay, yada yeah. yada. And who's doing the exercising? <laughs> What did you say? 
I think the thing at night is just that everybody has to be on the same page. And, okay, so there's always a caregiver here, and they all seem to like dogs. So I think if we instruct them that they have to let the dog out, bring it in, and, and I was going to suggest bring it to you for for cuddles. When you bring it in, yeah. Yeah, bring it to you for cuddles. Anyway. I already have sleep this night. <laughs> I was also, I don't know, is anything else? We had, there's a section here, questions from you guys. Questions, comments, concerns. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, just like you said, someone who's going to be responsible for all the, the dog things. And that's why I think it's really good timing when Nicole is here and, and we're not. And I think it's I think it's like adopting a baby that it's like very scary because it's the unknown right there. Yep. And it's like when we had Devin, you just struggle your way through and you figure out things as you go. Yeah. Right? That's what I mean. Like, do you, I can have like a straight answer to things when something goes yeah. on. Well. Yeah. Yeah. Like, how will and the dog might be better too. at some things and it might be worse exactly. at others. Kobe was a blessing. He didn't chew up too many chews. He didn't chew. Sometimes I've heard story, horror stories about. I shouldn't tell Chewing you. Chewing the walls. Yeah. But don't you worry. You have to get a square ball. That's I know once. Yeah. yeah. That's also why it has a. Those is great. Right? Yeah. yeah. That too. Oh, and the other the other thing that I'm thinking is we need to have a baby gate because I don't think it's fair for the dog to be in the caregiver space. Oh, like it's fine going downstairs. Yeah, yeah, going downstairs. I think it's fine for them to look after it when they're on shift, but I don't think it's fair for them to be him, it, her, she to be down there. They then. There are some really nice ones. Oh, the baby gates. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Like really nice. Yeah. Like we'll break something like, up. That don't one. get worried about the looks because guess what? You need it now and then it trains. Yeah. To not go down there. Yeah. But yeah. I don't Together and have like the manifesting. <laughs>